Hey, it's me Marita with another video. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please take this time to subscribe and enjoy. Now I have been incorporating aloe vera plant in my hair regimen lately and the first time I didn't record it but I still had another leaf left and so I froze it and now I just thawed it out and now I'm ready to record how I did my aloe vera juice so stay tuned. I must say the experience was a little different after freezing it because the aloe vera was so much thicker and more jelly like. Um, then the first time when I just did it fresh, it was more a little more watery. So I ended up having to do half aloe and half water just to thin it out some because it was just way too thick. So yeah. Now I'm ready to strain it and the thing with the strainer is that it can have little pieces in it that you don't want to get stuck in your hair, the jelly part, so you want to get as much of the juice out, out of it as possible. And I only have this small strainer, I have to invest into a bigger one so I can get more done at a time but I have to kind of do it like this because my strainer is so small so yeah, so it's important to strain it just so that you won't have chunks in your hair. Now it's ready to go into my applicator bottle or my spray bottle and that's what I do. It was running low and so I was ready to make some more for next week. So and I'll just fill that up and whatever else I have left I'll just put it in other bottles and mix it with my other sprays that I have. Here I'm just adding some um, essential oil, peppermint oil. Um, this just kind of helps with the smell and just gives it an extra tingle when you spray it on your scalp. Um, um, peppermint oil is really good for stimulating the scalp and getting hair growth started so um, it's a win-win. Here I'm just about to apply it to my edges. As you see my edges are extremely thin. They have actually been growing in a little since I've been doing this for about, it's been almost two weeks. and. I'm going to try to come back maybe every two weeks to let you see the difference in my edges um, to see um, how the growth goes so that we can kind of be on this journey together and just see how this works. So I've been on it for about two weeks and I'm already seeing a little bit of um, growth. Now, if you remember that I was doing fenugreek, I really haven't stopped doing the fenugreek. I still do this fenugreek water on my scalp as well I just wanted to incorporate it um, just incorporate the aloe vera so actually uh, I have been using so many natural products on my hair not just aloe vera I've been using moringa oil 
or moringa powder um, to make moringa oil. So I've been just doing a lot of stuff um, with natural things. Fenugreek, moringa, and aloe vera has been my main um, products that I've been using for to make things for my hair, a lot of DIY things. So if you want to see any, any of those things, just let me know. Um, especially if you want to see how I make the aloe vera oil. Um, I still have another batch to make. So if you want to see that, just drop it in the comment section and let me know if you want to see that video. And I'll try to record that for you. All right. I've really been trying to massage my hair more often. Um, I've never been a big hair massager, but lately I've been massaging my hair so much, especially since I have these twists in. Just because I feel like I have more access to my scalp, I've just been massaging my scalp a whole lot more. So um, just getting that blood flowing to the scalp to get that hair growth going is just very important. So always remember to massage your scalp when you, whenever you think about it. So now I'm just taking down my bands to knots just to get my hair ready for the day. I'm gonna probably style it off camera, but I'm glad I have this texture so then I can kind of have a little variety of um, what kind of style I can do with it. So yeah, this is my routine, my edge routine that I've tried to been doing like maybe two or three times a week I try to do my edges um, do this little treatment for my edges and don't get me wrong I do do the same thing for all the rest of my hair but I'm really really right now focusing on my edges e even more but I do you know moisturize all my hair I do oil all my scalp and I do massage my whole head but right now I'm really focusing on like I said on my edges to get those a little to get them a little thicker and um, to grow in more. So we'll see what happens. Just continue to hang with me on this journey and we'll see where it takes us. So hope you enjoyed the video and thank you so much for watching. Bye.